Air Force lacrosse coach Eric Saramet constantly talks to his team about how small decisions can change the course of their lives. Yeah, sports director Rob Namnoom shows us back in October of 2013, a car accident dramatically altered his life. This is a story you will only see on Cardio News Channel 13. My wife was everything good in a person, very kind hearted, just a real pleasant person to be around. Bright smile. Eric Saramit met his wife, Sonia, in 2004. They married four years later and have two children, Amelia and Annabelle. They enjoyed the outdoors together and loved the sense of adventure. This is what we did on the weekends. We were adventurous and we were like, well, let's not sit around. Let's go see if we can see some fall foliage and take a little drive. With their two little girls in the car, the drive continued toward Route 9 near Hartzell. Took a turn and, and then life, life changed. While Eric was driving, the car drifted toward the right side of the road. He overcorrected and the car rolled twice, hitting some fences and they ended up in a ditch. Sonia was ejected from the car. The family airlifted to the hospital. Sonia died from the injuries she suffered. She was 37 years old. We talk about it every night. Yeah. You know, my daughter, my daughter, nearly every night, talks about the fence we hit, talks about the helicopter, mommy going to heaven in the hell every night, every night. So that's part of my reality. Eric says he won't ask the question why. Whether I contributed to the hand being dealt, whether it was dealt to me, whether there's fate, whether there's God, whether there's reasons beyond our comprehension. The bottom line is, you know, I have two daughters to raise. It was the Air Force lacrosse family that helped Eric and his daughters during the grieving process. Here we go, do it again. The ball. Every day, Sonia's in their thoughts. I think of Sonia every day, and the best thing I could do is raise my daughters, uh, keep Sonia's spirit alive, talk about her, um, make sure she's a part of our every day. You know, I was very grateful that she's in my life. And as you can imagine, it was a trying time for Coach Sermon and his daughters. Uh, he says the support of his team, the Air Force Academy, the lacrosse community in general, the Colorado College lacrosse program, really supported him and helped his family through this tough ordeal. Very hard. Yeah, and luckily he has the right perspective. Uh, his daughters constantly talk about his wife. They keep her spirit alive, and it seems like he's doing a wonderful job as a single yeah. father. And hopefully the way he's handling it, can help other people who may be going through this same type of situation. Yeah, and I talked to his players and they seem to have learned from, you know, the tough times and the tragic times that he's been through, but mm. he's a fighter and uh, I want to thank Coach for letting us tell the story because uh, pretty difficult for him to oh. talk about. Yeah, that. you can, can see imagine. his daughters though adore him. Yeah. So that's, that's a tough road to do Love as a single dad. Love can conquer all sometimes. Yeah. That's right. All right, moving on. To